I've got commercial wind turbines all around me and uh, they'll be spinning all day long while this one is very seldom moving. Just approaching startup speed it does a lot of swinging because obviously the wind pushes the whole body of the uh, turbine and it's obviously the drag on the uh, turbine and the blade sends it sideways when the wind is strong enough it actually rotates the prop but it does a lot of swinging just before it starts to turn the wind has picked up and if I can find a tree tops of the trees are just shaking so we must be above 10 miles an hour it's definitely surprised me how much wind it needs to stir it to rotate and then again how much wind it actually needs to produce any usable power there's definitely a sweet spot around about that 15 to 25 mile an hour and there we go let's hope it keeps rotating and I can go to the controller and just show how little is generated at such low RPM. So we're whizzing around now and not really sure which way to point because we're in such a bad situation those trees are so close. But just to give you an idea of how much wind there is we'll check the meter. In that 15 to 20 mile an hour wind at best I was producing about 350 watts. Doubling the wind speed gives you eight times the power. It's an incredible amount of change when that speed increases of the wind. The location is so important, it's unbelievable. Open ground, high tower or on a hill, otherwise you're going to be very disappointed. I know my wiring is good, so I can now move on to either putting it on a higher tower or moving the location. So I'm quite happy.